Time for NBC10 Responds here, and there's, yeah, it's a lot of information on the internet, uh, internet about all of us, but what if there was a way to make it tougher to find something? Yeah, Google says it can do it. The company today announced a new function that will allow users to request certain information be wiped from its search engine. You can find just about anything on the internet. The web is just constantly taking in data. It never gives any back. Cybersecurity expert Matt Barnett says that includes your personal information. A lot of these things are being used to target us for spam and identity theft and just in general um, kind of nuisances. We're talking about phone numbers, emails, and home addresses. It kind of immortalizes things out there. And so there are things that, you know, we may not want out there. So Google plans to make it easier to filter out some of that information from its search engine results. People just generally seem to be concerned about their privacy for various reasons. Danny Sullivan is public liaison for Google Search. He says users have been able to request certain removals, but it can be a complicated process involving filling out a form and finding URLs. Now the company hopes to make it easier and more user friendly. Take a look. You'll be able to select the information you want removed and with a few clicks, ask Google to remove it. There are other things that can be removed, such as if someone had your bank account information and it has somehow got out online or medical records or government IDs, uh, even things like if your signature is out there, you don't want your signature to be present, um, you can remove that as well. Google will then review your submission to decide if it should be moved from a search. You should know not everything will qualify. We try to understand if there's a public issue, uh, a public, uh, uh, if it's a, a public record type of thing, or if it's like, you know, there's a, in, in some cases there might be a reason like there's news coverage or something and it may make sense to have it there uh, because of public interest. Sullivan tells NBC10 Response, the company expects to receive many requests and has a team ready to work on them. If they can keep up with the influx of, you know, or the increased rate of form submissions that they get, that, that this is going to be a good thing for them and, and a good thing for the general public as well. Now, something to remember, Google isn't removing the information from websites. It's restricting how the information comes up in its search engine only. The company plans on rolling out this new function this summer. Jim?